You may remember last week we covered a story out of Elkins concerning a veteran's urn that was found in an apartment complex dumpster. After an urn of a veteran was found in an Elkins apartment dumpster by two sanitary workers earlier this month, the race for identification began immediately after. The sanitary workers contacted Post 29 Elkins American Legion for help, who then shared the urn on social media as well as news outlets for greater outreach. Not even a full week after the Legion had received the urn, a phone call came through claiming the urn and providing more information on how it was displaced. You know, we all believe in the man upstairs, and I think this is a way for him to get to what where he's he wanted. Yeah. The urn was identified to be Robert Deeth, a veteran of the Vietnam War serving as an air traffic controller in the U.S. Air Force. Deeth received the Bronze Service Star, the Republic of Vietnam Gallantry Cross with device, and the Republic of Vietnam Campaign Medal for his services. After a number of passings of Deeth's close relatives, the urn was displaced by workers of the apartment complex, though at no fault of their own. Those workers that was cleaning out that apartment, they did not know what that urn is. When you say urn, we all think of the vase type urn, yeah. but not everybody can afford that, you know? And so a very simple box, little metal box that's screwed shut is all that someone can afford. And not knowing what it was, it could have been like a time capsule or something simple. It was just at the time for them, garbage in the way. They did not know. Yeah. So you can't blame those people for yeah. it. Deeth's son, who now resides in Florida, stated that his father's final wishes were to be buried in Elkins' Little Arlington Cemetery, to which Post 29 intended to do originally if Deeth had not been identified. The Legion has already arranged a service and memorial for Deeth once he's laid to rest, and the two sanitation workers who found Deeth are planning to be in attendance. Reporting from Elkins, I'm Jalen Lamp with 12 News.